Al-Qaeda-linked rebels have attacked a Christian village in Syria, home to one of the world's oldest monasteries. The army has secured much of the township, but residents say radical opposition fighters have seized nearby hills and are firing indiscriminately at the community. Our correspondent in Damascus, Maria Finoshna, reports. We tried to get to Malula village uh, uh, shortly after we heard that the clashes erupted there. It's just one hour drive from Damascus, north of uh, the capital. But we were stopped by the army and warned that it could be a one-way ticket because, first of all, the road from Damascus to Malula is not safe. But even if we are lucky Hello. enough to get uh, 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 to the village, the clashes still continue there and there are still some snipers who are active on the ground. So the situation is very dangerous. So it's better not to go there, as we were told. We are hearing that the fighting is between the army and uh, the militants, uh, mostly uh, from Jabhat al-Nusra, al-Qaeda-affiliated group fighting here in Syria uh, uh, against uh, the regime of Bashar al-Assad, but mostly for their own uh, radical Islam uh, state. It's known, it's believed to be the best armed, uh, the most successful, and uh, at the same time, the most aggressive opposition force uh, here here in Syria, and it's listed as a terrorist organization by the UN, US, and some other members of the international community. And uh, oh. we can see that the tactics uh, were also uh, uh, very uh, similar to those that terrorists all around the world use. Uh, we know that uh, 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 early uh, on Wednesday, uh, a suicide bomber struck uh, a checkpoint at the entrance of Malula village. Uh, and after a car exploded at the checkpoint, uh, the militants of Jabhat al-Nusra stormed in. And we have online video, and I, I hope you can see it right now, uh, showing rebels uh, entering the city. And uh, residents have been uh, telling uh, media that uh, the same day the militants managed to uh, take over uh, a mountaintop Safir Hotel, and they've been firing from uh, that strategic point. What we know is that my Malula village is a very special place, not only speaking uh, 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 in terms of uh, Syrian reality, but internationally speaking. It is home to an Orthodox shrine, a fourth century uh, Catholic church, and dozens of mosques. So uh, its religious heritage is very solid, and it was protected by the government, and it was uh, what we saw during this crisis, respected by the rebels. But after this recent attack, of course, the whole Christian Christian community, not only here in Syria, but all over the world, was shaking. And uh, let's now listen to uh, one nun, uh, RT, uh, managed to speak from Latakia, uh, what uh, she says about the situation and about the fears of uh, the Christian minority here in Syria. How can the international community ignore the brutal killing spree in Latakia early on August the 5th? an attack that affected 500 people, including children, women and older people. In the village of Estreba, they massacred all the residents and burned down their houses. In another village, almost all of the 37 locals were killed. Only 10 people were able to escape. Twelve Alawite villages were subjected to this horrendous attack. It was a true slaughterhouse. People were mutilated and beheaded. There is even a video that shows a girl being dismembered alive with a soul. Well, it's worth to mention that Malula has very troubled neighbors. Uh, another village of uh, Yabrud, center of smuggling here in Syria, is just 20 minutes drive uh, from Malula, Homs, the city known as the epicenter of the clashes, uh, 100 kilometers away from Malula. But uh, we are hearing from some uh, Free Syrian Army members that, so from some opposition members, that uh, the idea of attacking this village was uh, to clear the road from the city of Homs in central Syria to Damascus, because uh, this village was the only one not uh, taken, not uh, uh, touched by the rebels. But these are just rumors. It's very hard to confirm.